Uh, Patrick, Steve here from StephenBigCounty.com. Oh, Steve. Hey, hi, hi, Steve. Hi, Patrick. If the entire roster of golfers this week were struck down tragically by a bowl of lightning or something, would you even care, or would you just keep on rolling? Probably still be rolling. I mean, it'd be moving, but uh, I think for about two seconds till you know, I realized I'd become instantly world number one. But I think it's kind of funny that you guys say this to me because it was only last night. Um, you know, I sat down and, and made a list of, of literally all the professional golfers, you know, that I like or respect. And um, my name was the only name on the list. And well, me and my dog Barney. Um, but needless to say, he's not he's not a professional golfer. And well, technically, he's not alive either. He passed away some years back and. Uh, he used to give me great advice though, even for a dog. He, he would bark at me and I knew what he was trying to say was never be nice. But this is beside the point. I mean, you know, you guys have the totally wrong idea about me. Um, you know, I do a lot of work for charity. And, um, you know, I talk to Jordan Speed, for example, and, and anyone who's ever had to talk to Jordan would understand why that's, that's charity work. And. Uh, only recently I helped Matt Kuchar track down that $5 bill that he was looking for and, and helped him get it back off that kid who picked it up. But, um, you know, at the end of the day, guys, I'm, you know, I'm a professional golfer. I play golf for a living. And, uh, you know, if you can find a tournament where I can win a million bucks by, you know, being someone's best friend, well, you know, give me a call. But, you know, till then, I'll just keep grabbing more of these green jackets and this is going to be my week.